Well, Lee, thanks for talking to us again. I know we spoke over, just over a week ago and you were saying things were moving along and progressing. You were taking your time. You were going to get the right people in. You made another signing. Tell us about it. Yep, uh, we got Shiloh Tracy in from Cambridge. Um, really delighted that he signed. Um, a lot of clubs after him, even the league above, even down to this morning. Um, so, you know, it's gone all the way to the wire. I'm thrilled to have him in. He's going to be exciting. He's at a good age, 25, um, knows where he wants to get to, and I believe we can help him get there um, and help us improve um, with what we've got in the building already. His pedigree is very good, isn't it? He's, you know, he started out as a youngster at Tottenham Hotspur. Yeah, he's got a really good background, um, and these are the things that we look for as well. Um, what, what's his background? You know, really good upbringing. Um, was it non-league and then went um, to Spurs um, and then he's played in League One for the last couple of years you know so he ticks all my boxes and I believe he can only get better um, so we're delighted to have him again stiff competition for him um, he seems a, a really focused young man in terms of what he wants to achieve and I'm sure we can we can help each other every club that's going through this particular part of the season trying to get new players of fighting off opposition whether you've got mega millions to spend or you've got minimal uh, thousands to spend but you've fought off big competitions to get Shiloh here how does that make you feel that you've been able to attract him yeah we obviously we, we, we tell them obviously what we can do to improve them um, individually and how they can improve our team uh, and I believe that's a big selling point point for us what we have to do is we have to honor what we're saying look we also explain about 11 v 11 games winning football matches um you know but he knows he's going to get the care and attention like every player we feel does here to try and improve him um you know so like we said we have we have um, particularly a, a team from the division above uh, had to face some um, fierce competition again it's just been total dialogue with him and his agent his agent's been here this morning I've been open and honest in terms of exactly where he was even at half past nine half past ten this morning um but like I said we're thrilled and delighted and I believe the fans will really enjoy watching him play yeah and he's at that age isn't he where you know there's still plenty of things to to look forward to there's ambition in there for him to do well with the football club that's the word ambition um not only you know as we speak a lot about it, the individual but as a team i know where we want to get to and who we need to get to get to that point um obviously we need a couple more bodies in um, which we'll be working on but people like shiloh uh, you know really a step in the right direction in terms of where we want to get to with, with our with our team as a collective just wrapping it all up just a word or two on your your other sign the other day we, we spoke to him of course and we We've enjoyed this, you know, early stages of being here for, for you. And another player that's coming in with experience, but still got a lot of life left in him, in Ryan Cooney. Yeah, and again, good pedigree, come through at Burnley. Um, there was a lot of talk of him when he was younger, going off to Premier League clubs um, to be a part of their development or B teams. Um, again, got a promotion under his belt, um, played uh, League One football. Um, again, we know what areas we needed to improve on and what we wanted to look to do. And um, we're really pleased to have him in, in, in the squad um, because again in terms of markers he ticks a lot of what I'm after with players um, a real determined player um, who's still again young enough um, to improve and we know again what areas we want to look to make him improve um, to get him on the pitch and, and, and I believe we've got a really good player a leader he's a natural leader he, he, at 23 um, you don't think associate that with you know but he is a real leader on the pitch um, plays with his heart and again I think the fans will enjoy the, the endeavour that he puts into his game he's got some quality obviously with his background as a, as a younger player um, but again someone we're really delighted um, to to get through the door we highlighted him a long time ago um, a long long time ago so we're, de we're delighted to um, to get him in the building and part of the squad we're just wrapping it all up you've welcomed your players back for the first day you sent one or two home worn out have you I believe Harvey's gone home early yet after working with Fed. No, it'll be a shock to his system, Harvey. Um, something a little bit different to what he's been used to. But again, really good character. He, he'll be working. Um, but no, been a light introduction this morning. Um, we got the, got the uh, testing out the way. A lot of the times you do the testing and then it's on to pre-season in the afternoon. It just doesn't work. So we've had a full clear day of um, doing testing with a bit of running at the end. And uh, got some good scores to be fair to him. They've looked after themselves.